All right, Thanksgiving, our next big holiday coming up in the U.S., and, um, and, and they've said this year will probably cost the most ever when it comes to making your Thanksgiving meal. So you're thinking, gosh, how can I save money on my Thanksgiving meal when it comes to uh, cooking for the entire family? Eat ramen noodles. Or besides skipping it all together. Oh, okay, gotcha. All right, some, some different ways to do this. Number one, buy in bulk when you can. Um, but you got to have the storage to do that true. or or if you're going to share with somebody else. Like if you know you've got a friend or a sibling in the area and you can like buy in bulk and then yeah. share the cost, there's ways to do it. But uh-huh. the average consumer, their fridge, freezer, pantry, eh, it's right. not really equipped for it. Uh, they say use a list, number one, so you don't buy extra stuff you don't need. Uh, they say <laughs> two, um, buy store brand when you need to. Um, because a, a lot, lot of times products, certain things taste yes, the same anyway. Yes. It and doesn't matter. If they're part of an overall recipe, they're an additive to it, depending on what the ingredient is. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of things you can work around with, with the store brand. There's yeah. certain things though that definitely have a distinctive taste or mm-hmm. texture you need. So it's relative. Yeah. Um, they say too, I mean, there's, there's different clubs and points and, and th- ways to save money on your grocery bill that way. That's a good thing to do. Um, also they say too, um, maybe some higher priced staples you've been used to. Maybe you skip that and get something cheaper and start something different, a new, a, new, a tradition. new tradition. Yeah. Um, Watch the flyers, though, too. Watch the online sales. Because, oh, yeah. say, American Thanksgiving, there's still a few weeks till that happens, and even Christmas dinner. If you see it's on sale, but you know that you don't have the holiday for another couple of weeks, buy a couple of things now. Have that list on your fridge. Yeah. Cross them out. Yeah. And then you can use a coupon or get cost savings that way. You don't have to do it all in one fell swoop if you're strategic about it. They say to buy your produce in bulk if you can. Spinach, red, white onions, sweet potatoes, squash, pumpkins. If you can buy them early and store them, I guess, for yeah, a little you while. you dry them, store them, freeze them. Right. Some people have like a root cellar, which is great for things like potatoes. Mm. And, and honestly, potatoes last a really long time. So even when they start yeah. to grow an eye out of them, the potato itself is fine. They're just trying to regenerate. Um, and as far as like turkey is concerned, if you don't need to have a full on big turkey, don't get that. Get turkey legs, turkey breasts. Uh, that's cheaper and easier to prepare. Some people anyway. get duck or chicken too. Yeah, that's it's still too. poultry. So you have options. Yeah, something different. Yep. More info about this right now at the Yes FM Facebook, Twitter at nine six seven Yes FM, and the Mercer Morning page at yesfm.com.